Hi everyone, welcome back to Plum Mashable. So for today's video we're going to be going through the second of my kits from Planners Anonymous. This one is Country Cottage, so let's go ahead and get to it. Alright, I have been so excited for this kit. I love blues, I love bunnies, and I love, I think, I, 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 I know what flower I'm thinking of, I can't think of the name, but I think that's the flower that's in here. So I'm interested to see if I'm right. So I'm just jumping into the regular kit first. Oh, the goodies. Okay. Oh, that's cool. Sorry. There are so many. I, I have tried to avoid spoilers because I feel like for you guys... I'm much more excited when I haven't already seen what's in the kit. So I do try and avoid the spoilers a little bit and I'm really happy I did because I've just seen that one and I'm really happy with it. Anyway, um, let's start off with the uh, like the intro card and art card. So let's grab into this one. Hold there, die cuts. Okay, move all this off. Oh my goodness! It wasn't me! Oh, that's adorable! That's adorable. Uh, and then on the back it says flowers and love is up. Flowers and love are in the air. I love growing flowers. The smell of them floating on fresh air is divine. Take a wander down Bunny Lane with me and we can relax with the locals from Marina. Oh, is it chrysanthemums? Are they the big blue ones? I don't even know. Anyway, and then you on the back you've got the little rabbit in the... It wasn't me. That's so cute. That's so cute. Oh, I love that. Uh, and then the pen is this gorgeous light teal, tealy blue. It's, it's not blue blue, it's, it's something more than that. Uh, and then it's got blue and green gems all through that. It's got silver hardware. Oh, love. Love. All right, I'm going to go to the stamp set because I'm just in love with it. So you've got five little bunnies here. So you've got one when you've got his butt. You've got one sort of sitting up over the front, which would look absolutely gorgeous, by the way, in this bike. You've got a little bunny with his nose to the ground. You've got one sort of sitting in that it wasn't me position. And then you've got a little regular bunny. You've got two quotes. Some bunny loves you and shake your cotton tail. You've got two lots of flowers. Oh, and hop to it. Sorry, I forgot about that. Two flowers. You've got this big bike, which that bunny will fit perfectly in. But it's this one that I went, oh, wow. Because I can make some really pretty backgrounds with that. And you know what I'm going to do with my weekly decoration with this one. I'm going to brick the whole thing. Oh yeah. I'm so excited. Um, that's gorgeous. And it can be, bricks are so, so versatile. Like you can use them with, obviously with greys, which would fit in with this kit, which will probably, probably what I'll do when I do that one. But that would look beautiful as a red brick too. Oh, so good. So good, so good, so good. All right, let's have a look at the bonus item. I think it's a pen holder, if I'm right. I think. So you've got the Oh, mm. it's it's it is PU leather, but it's very soft, and your little pen sits in there. And you could stick that in the back of your planner or in the front of your planner. So this is uh, books and botanicals. It's just the one that I'm using at the moment. So you could just slip that in the front there, and it holds a pen. Or if you wanted to, you could put it in here. Ha <laughs> ha! So many things you can do. I love little pockets like that. I really, really do. This is the one that I'm using for my social media at the moment, so I'm very happy with that. Let's have a look at the die cuts. Oh my goodness, the floral goodness in this. Oh yeah. Let's have a look. Don't get stuck. Right. See if I can keep this all in shot. So we've got uh, Marina holding her flowers. We've got a border. We've got the bunny lane with all of the, the rabbits taking over. Hydrangeas, that's the one, it's not chrysanthemums, apologies. Uh, so you've got some hydrangea seeds, some cotton seeds, that looks like basil, some tulips, and that one just says flowers, that's cute. Got some little petals, got that bike with that little bunny in there. Got a big version of the bunny with a bit of a shadow, which is really cute. Got some florals, now this one would be really cool too, I don't want to, I don't, don't want to actually do it. But you could fold it over and it would be a really good page tab or page marker. Got the little I didn't do it bunny. Got another one of the bunnies with his shadow. Fresh flowers. Another one of those fold over ones. Another one with his shadow. 
got a little set of the minis. Oh, I love her braided hair. Oh, I hope we get to see someone with braided hair. Some more little ones. You got a smaller version of the rabbit that's stuck. You got some gorgeous buckets and um, watering jugs. Oh, that's gorgeous. Got some bottles. I'm gonna move those around. Got some of these leaves too, with that in that folding style. And some tulips. Oh, I like that. Oh, there's a lot of them. Oh, I like the folding one, Sammy. Well done. Got the cotton. And then we've got one more little leaf. That's a gorgeous set of die cuts. I love the seeds. I'm, I'm actually sitting here trying to think, how do I make something with those seeds? Because I think they would make something really cool. I'm just trying to work out what that would be. But there we go. That's all the die cuts. Oh, they're just adorable. Okay. I'm, I'm leaving the washi tape because I'm so excited to see it that it's just not funny. So I'm just waiting. So this is the standard sticker kit. So you get two pages in this. So the first page here, you've got a bit of the deco stuff. So you've got that bucket, got Marina with her flowers, the fresh flowers, the seed packets, and then this is like a, a sticker strip. So you've got a good chunk of that. And then the second one, you've got your numbers. This week, next week, noted focus, self-care, important your foldable sticker, your um, tracking numbers, and then your dates there as well. This one as well is another um, sticker, so you've got plenty there to use. Oh, I don't know if I want to do the washi tape or if I want to do the um, sticker book, but I'm going to do the washi tape, so I'm just going to go ahead and open these up. So this is just a quick little thought. Um, if you do have any sticker paper just sitting around, like the release paper, or if you've got a reusable sticker book, chuck your stickers on there. I was thinking about it the other day when I was laying in bed, and instead of having those little bits of plastic like I had with Book Lover, I just took everything off and just stuck it on there, and now I've got three stickers. And I was careful when I took these off. Uh, okay, so I'm going to start off with the wide one. Oh my god. I just saw a little sneak peek of it, and I'm just, I'm in love. The blues. <gasps> oh. And it's a good repeat too. Oh my goodness. So that's the size of your repeat right there. It's huge. I'm just going to take off the other. So that's a, just the star bit of it. So that's your whole piece there. And you've got bunnies and you've got flowers and you've got that gorgeous blue and then you've got the bucket at the end. Oh my goodness. That's stunning. And you've got the silver speckles. I don't know if you can see the sort of silver on the outside, on the shine there but it's gorgeous then you've got the medium one which has got all of these gorgeous bunnies oh it does have a quote on it so i'm just gonna i'm just trying to find that there it is so it's got the cotton kind of background so it's a gray you got all the little bunnies with the speckles and the hearts and then you've got a little one here that says shake your cotton tail oh my goodness and then the skinny one is this gorgeous blue oh my goodness i am dying with this blue with little, little silver. Oh, oh, it goes green. I just thought it was plain blue. Check that out. Oh, wow. So it starts blue and then it goes green and then it goes back to blue. <gasps> oh, I love that. Oh, my goodness. They are three of the most gorgeous washi tapes I've ever seen. Oh, in love. Absolutely in love. Oh, I will never get over how beautiful Planners and Lilith's washi tape is. And I am... I'm on a washi tape sabbatical. That's not actually true. I got some more washi tape the other day. Um, I am not allowed to buy washi tape that's not special. So I can buy stuff from Fox and Cactus. I can buy stuff from Planners Anonymous. I can buy stuff from anywhere, Mr. Moose, but I can't buy stuff from like Kmart or um, Office Works or anything like that. I have to buy good quality washi because I have too much washi tape. That's what I found out. And if you want to see how much washi tape I have, go and check out my washi swatch book because holy moly do I have too much washi tape. Uh, okay, so then I want the, that's the additional papers. I want the standard papers. Oh my goodness, that bell on. I just saw the bell. Dying. Dying over here. Okay, so we have. I'm not looking. So you've got the, the sort of bunny lane one there. So you've got the laneway with the... Oh, I didn't think to use the bricks as the ground. I always thought about it as a wall. That's brilliant. Um, you've got your bunny lane, you've got your windows, and then you've got your little rabbits sort of poking up out of everywhere. 
and on the back of that one you have this gorgeous blue oh wow that so sometimes with the PA papers the the water spatters seem to be sort of like a I don't know they're not as bold these ones are bold and they're really lovely I love that and then you've got the bunnies with the little the little cotton and a little brown background and that's on a brown Okay, this one might be my favourite. You've got the tulips and the white flowers on the dark blue with the pops of green. Is this not my favourite kit? Oh my god. And this comes on a green. And then the vellum. Oh my goodness. Hold on, I need to move this up because you need to see this against white. Oh, that blue. So it's a zoomed in version. It's a zoomed in version of this but with a plain white background and I love that oh my goodness and then your acetate is silver so it's got all of the beautiful flowers there and it's silver on both sides so you will not be disappointed with that oh my goodness okay so then moving on to the additional stick additional papers additional stickers oh, I feel like a kid at Christmas so you get your extra bit of vellum oh and acetate I'm having I'm having palpitations in here this is just gorgeous oh I love that okay and then the papers so the first one you've got sort of a brick wall with all of those um, windows how cute would that look with the doors opening and there being a little rabbit sitting behind it not that I've thought about it and that comes on a gorgeous gray then you've got your planter boxes. So you've got all of them along here with all of your beautiful bunnies. And you've got a little spot up here where there's sort of one without the planter box. That's really cute. Got the bike sitting there. And this is on like a, it's like the, the teal of the, um, slightly, actually no, it's about the same color as the, as the pen. Um, just a slightly sort of tealy blue. And then the next one is this gorgeous seed packet. Oh, I just love I don't know why I'm so in love with the seeds. And that comes on this gorgeous brown. Oh, I love that. Oh, they are some gorgeous papers. They are some gorgeous papers. And then let's have a look at the sticker book because there's more O's coming. I can feel them. I am loving the sticker books. I will be honest, I'm absolutely adoring these. So you've got your little cover here. First page here has your boxes. So you've got a couple of boxes down the bottom with your planter boxes. Got your bucket of flowers. These ones all have silver foil details to them. You've also got that bit at the bottom, which is a strip. The side bit is not a strip, but you could easily cut it out. You could just fussy cut it. Second one here also has silver. So they've got silver. Um, oh, you got the girl with the braids. Uh, silver highlights on this one. You've got a little planter box. You've got that rabbit. You've got some quotes. So you've got shake the shaky cotton tail. Um, look at you grow oh that's cute hoppy like a bunny hop to it find me in the garden the garden is my happy place I love that and then you've got your plain oh no that's got silver foil to it too just one but your more plain ones you've got your corners and your borders uh, and your labels you've got all your minis there so you've got the girl with the gorgeous braid that looks like indie is that what it's supposed to be Sammy is it supposed to be indie because it looks like indie I uh, got your first lot of weeklies. I love it. They're the flags. That's really cute. Just for something different. So you've got your boxes that go down the side and then you've got your flags. You've got the grey. Well, not, I keep saying grey. It's not grey. It's brown. Um, but with the sun bunny loves you and the shaky cotton tail and the, and the days. You've got the blues and the greens. It's your time to bloom with the gorgeous sparkles. And then a more plain one again. Greens and blues. Then you've got two, oh, you've got your um, your vinyl stickers, so your clear ones. Oh, come on. Come on. Oh, yeah. Oh, I can't wait to play with that. That jar. I think, oh, too many ideas with this kit. Uh, you've got your functional kind of ones, boxes, bit of washi strip, dots, more washi strips, more boxes. And then you've got your foiled notes and stuff. So you've got work, numbers, and then all your sort of days, um, all your sort of little notes. You've also got some extra days here if you need to use them. So there we go. That is everything that we get in Country Cottage. Oh. Don't ask me to pick my favourite by the end of this because I don't think I'll be able to. Um, 
I just, what I love, what I love. By the time we get to the end of this, I'm going to have four new kits and they are all completely different. And I just, that's what I love about PA. Like from month to month, you just get such a different variety of stuff, different, a different feel. Like Book Lover was very rich and very, um, I don't know how you explain it. It's it, it was a very deep, saturated kind of kind of kit, and then this feels so light and bright and breezy. And then I'm sure Australiana, which is coming up for you next, um, is going to feel completely different as well. And I just love it. It's just as much as I have hated waiting, this is actually a lot of fun opening them one by one by one in quick succession because you just get that sort of more com more complete comparison between them. So like I said, that is Country Cottage. If you want to see uh, the unboxing of Book Lover, you can check out my playlist. I've got all my other unboxings of all of my Planners Anonymous kits. But like I said, Australiana is coming up next. It'll be up next week. So make sure you are subscribed if you don't want to miss that. If you did like this video, please give it a thumbs up. Don't forget to subscribe for lots more Planners Anonymous fun because there will be lots of Planners Anonymous fun in the next couple of weeks. Uh, so make sure you do if you are interested in that. I hope you guys have an absolutely awesome rest of your day and I'll catch you in my next video. Sending lots of huggles. Bye!